this course has activity completion enabled as you can see by the little tick alongside each of these activities you'll also find in the reports down in the navigation block that there's activity completion there as well and in this activity completion report you get a very quick indication of who has done what and you can download in an Excel spreadsheet as well and on the side here you've also got something that says completion tracking now if you haven't got any of that what you need to do is enable it in your settings of your course so click on edit settings in the settings block go down a little way until you see student progress and make sure this is enabled right the default for the older programs might be disabled just make sure it's enabled I also tick that little box there but that's not essential then go to the bottom and save changes now that that's enabled you should see all those things that I showed you you won't see any of these ticks until you set the completion conditions for all the items on your page.